If you've been to the grocery store lately, you've probably had to pack your patience. Shoppers are finding plenty of these empty shelves. Some of their favorite items are missing. Good evening, everybody. You guessed it. It is all connected to COVID and supply chain shortages. That's right. So 12 News reporter James Grant joins us live tonight to explain what items are hard to find right now and just how some Southeast Texans are reacting. Leticia, Jordan, we decided to see for ourselves what sought after items are out of stock right now and are there any substitutes available? We scrolled through Facebook to find out what items Southeast Texans are struggling to track down. Foods like Eggos, Lunchables, Topo Chico, Fritos, Baby Formula, Bread, and Funyuns were some of the most mentioned items. So we decided to see for ourselves, are these items really not available and what are the alternatives? After placing an Instacart order to Kroger, we were able to get most of the items we ordered, but they had to substitute Fritos scoops for original Fritos and Lunchables ham and cheddar cheese for the ham and American cheese version. Version. Megan Mistrick, a Nederland mom of three young kids, says she's been struggling to find essential items like baby formula and milk. Unfortunately, I had to uh, fall back onto the Amazon world and order it where it comes every other week at our house. Mistrick says she and her family have spent up to a half a day just trying to track down items like bread, Lunchables, milk, and other food. Between this and the prices of certain items like milk going up, Mistrick says it can be stressful trying to feed her kids. We'll start off at our favorite store and end up at, you know, other stores. So not my most favorite stores. And then you end up spending more money in regardless at the end. Mr. says she started buying in bulk and thinking outside the box when it comes to groceries, turning to pharmacies like Walgreens to find some of her must have items. You just have to search your deals and try to make it work. But it is hard to like make sure everybody has everything they need now, Mistrick isn't the only mom getting creative when it comes to finding solutions for these shortages. Now, some parents tell us they're making their own Lunchables at home and others are also shopping for groceries at non-traditional locations like pharmacies and dollar stores. Live in Beaumont, James Grant, 12 News.